What's up, everybody? This is Chuck It's with Simply Vegas, realtor out here in Las Vegas, Nevada, bringing you another property tour. We are located out here in the South Valley. We're going to be taking a tour in the neighborhood, well, actually, in the master plan community, Southern Highlands, and the neighborhood is called the Coves. And the uh, filter is actually a uh, Pulte. So as you can see, we have the entryway here. So this property right here will actually start off at 300 and I'm sorry, 436 thousand eight hundred eighty-eight dollars. As you can see, it is a single story. This one is 2,313 square feet and has a total of three bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms. And you actually have an option den on the third bedroom. And what you'll see is all the uh, ceilings will be 10 feet on this single story. So this looks like a two by eight. You'll have tile in all the wet areas. You have your tub shower combo. As you can see, you have your six inch baseboards and your orange peel. Coming into your second bedroom. So let's take a look at here. Standard den in lieu of the fourth bedroom. So it's uh, actually a 10 by 10. Okay. Very small closet space. That's for sure. It's a little dark too, right here. If you notice, I would definitely have like a glass window right here. So as we come on down to the right, we actually have the the uh, cafe. Nice stonework in the uh, the back here. Now here's the thing: you can actually have the developer go ahead and uh, install this, but it's going to cost you more money as far as for uh, retail. This looks to be about a 10 by 12, okay? You have your engineering flooring transition into your tile. So we're coming across here. You have your laundry room. Okay. It doesn't come with the washer and dryer. So that is a two car garage, but obviously it is a, a private area for the office. Now right here is actually your mud room, but I think it's a dead waste of space. Here is your public restroom. Model homes will always have one designated public restroom. Okay. Looks like we have Ample storage, coat closet. You have your two by four. So we're gonna uh, take a look at the uh, master. Okay, so the master is separate from the others, which is great. So as we come in, let's take a look at the bedroom first. Wow, I like those windows. A lot of developers are putting those windows right there off onto the side. Wow, beautiful storage. Look look at this, people always ask, can you put a, a pool in a small area? Yeah, you can, but I mean, it just becomes a tub. Now we're also about a couple minutes from the uh, Karen Airport. So let me show you guys something here. 
we're going to start using McCarran Airport as a barometer. As you can see, we're located right here on the south side. And as we scroll down, there's McCarran International. Right across the street is Las Vegas Boulevard. You're about 18 minutes away. So, um, you know, we're so far in here where there's nothing out here, which is nice and peaceful. And if you want to go down south, you actually head south in the 15, you head out to California. And look how remote this is. But also, if you want to get to, you know, the city life, it's not that far from, from here to get there. Okay. This room only looks to be about 15 by 15, I would say. I mean, it, it is a decent sized room. Now, let's come into here to the master bath. It looks like we have granite. Beautiful oval tub. A little small for my taste, but take a look at the sink. That is an upgrade. Let's take a look at the quality of the cabinets. Um, decent cabinets up in the front. Now this one actually has a track on this one. And these are actually stapled. This is a MDF or Famica with a laminate. Okay. But I mean, they're, they're still good. There's nothing wrong with it. And also keep in mind, you'll have your options to pick your upgrades to and the style of the, uh, the cabinet. So uh, if you want more quality, you, you can add more quality. That's just up to you. Also, I don't know if I didn't mention that the HOAs for this community and also uh, the master plan fee for Southern Highlands is gonna run you about $150 a month, which is not bad at all. Love the shower. It's a little bit tight in here, a little bit echoey. Small little storage place. This is a pretty small home though. But let's go, let's go out into the uh, living room area, let's see what they got. Half back, let, let's go outside. So you have this little cover uh, patio area. This looks to be about like eight by 10. Pretty decent size and it is a covered and I believe it does come with it too as well. The sliding glass door, it's actually a true two panel door. It's not a pocket door, but definitely comes with this. This side right here is probably going to be an option upgrade right next to the cafe. Coming on this side, I'm sure there's really nothing on that side right there. So, a little tight. So, I guess if you wanted to put a pool, you still could put a pool. But man, there's just no room, right? But remember, this community actually has a pool too. So, you know, would you spend the extra, you know, 10, 15 grand to put in a pool when it already comes with a pool? So those are things that you actually have to um, take a look at. Come in here and close the door here. So here's the uh, ca cafe area. Decent size, it definitely looks like to be a 10 by 10. Nice lighting, recess lighting. Okay. Let's uh, take a look at the uh, cabinets. The grill is not standard. Okay. Also, we have the pantry. Okay, so there's no lights in the pantry. Pops up something and says, Oh, geez, you can't do this. And, you know, so it just takes a little time. But I can 
nice color cabinets. And I like how we have this bottom crown right here. This is really nice. You have your uppers. Now this um, stove definitely does not come with it, so you just keep that in mind. Here's your cabinets. It's funny how they give you a little as-is price, don't they? If you want it as the model. So here's your island. Right. Dishwasher. Yeah. The, the sink does not come with it as well. Now you redid your floor, you did. Okay. See if I can get you guys a better perspective, but we're gonna come down here real quick. So that way you can see the butler's pantry. Okay. Decent size. Butler's pantry. So this is more of a traditional home. So the the thing about it is a lot of people don't really use this anymore as far as like a formal dining area. So I, I guess it's more style and preference. But this will give you a better idea of what everything looks like here. Okay. Hmm. Looks like you got your built-in refrigerator. So, I mean, this is a pr pretty decent size room for 2,300 square feet. So, let me know what you guys think about this uh, property here. Do you think this property is actually worth the three uh, four hundred and thirty six thousand let me know in the comments be comments below and also don't forget to uh, subscribe to this channel I'm Chuck it's Cruise what with simply Vegas and have a blessed day